it is Shelly hanging out backstage, Lunatic Blue Owl 17, and I have one of Avenged Sevenfold with me. What's up, Zachy? Right yes, here? Zachy, I got a guitar player. Yes. Yeah. If you can call me that. What? Why wouldn't I? Don't, weren't you like um, one of the best metal guitar players last year? Was, didn't you win that award? Possibly, but, uh, you know, it's not saying much. There's not not a whole lot as far as metal goes. You know, yeah, those guys don't really shred very hard. So <laughs> They don't shred at all, but you guys do, actually. The, the new album, the old albums, I mean, that is one of the things that you guys are known for is just tearing it up on the guitar. But The Stage is the song that we play all the time. Cool. Dude, that's like... 12 minutes of guitar yeah. solos. We uh, we have fun with it. We want to make a long song. We want it to be ambitious and give our fans something to take over the airwaves with, I guess. But it's fun. It's, Just let it's the amazing. guitars wail and, you know, <laughs> okay. do. This new album was kind of a trip because it came out of nowhere. You just dropped it on us out of nowhere. It came out in, like, October, right? But yes, the, maybe. The, like, right before it came out, we heard from Chris Jericho, of all people, that it was going to come out in, like, November or December. It was going to be called something else. What happened? What was all that about? What is that guy? I know he's around here somewhere. Um, <laughs> yes. We wanted to do something special for our fans. We wanted to do something that no rock bands dared do. It was a full experiment. Um, we wanted, instead of building anticipation, and we wanted to not keep our fans waiting. Was, was it the right decision? I know a lot of our fans were super excited. I know yeah. it scared a lot of people, <laughs> including ourselves. But at this point, everything that we do, we're looking out to make it exciting for our fans. So it was a little bit um, unorthodox and... You know, I think half the world still doesn't even know we have an album out, which is okay because that's why we're here. We're no, gonna play. We're gonna yeah. we'll keep keep doing our thing, you know. And hopefully, when they when they do find out about it, and you know, it'll be a nice a nice pleasant surprise. You got Neil deGrasse Tyson on. Is it the last song on the album? Yes. How cool is that? He's the coolest. Oh, it was awesome. Yeah. <laughs> How we, did that happen? But, um, with this album, we just wanted to do something a little bit more thought provoking and a little bit more. Uh, a little bit more mature, you know. I'm not gonna say musically it's the most mature album we've ever done, but it's wanted... a trip. It is a, that that song with Neil deGrasse Tyson. That the drums will take you on a trip on that song. And that's what we wanted to do. You know, we've been listening to lots of Pink Floyd, lots of cool stuff, thinking about you know the universe and our place in the universe, and and uh, reading you know books, you know, from Neil deGrasse Tyson and uh, everything from Undeniable, from Bill Nye, just fun stuff. You know, yeah. you get older, you want you you know you want to expand the mind, expand the mind. So. <laughs> We thought it'd be a great, uh, a, a great addition to the album to have him come and lend his voice for a it monologue. Is, and it's so cool. <laughs> someday we'll send it into outer space. <laughs> yeah, there cool. you go. <laughs> Beam it to the aliens, wherever they are. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, what about? I've heard that Cirque du Soleil is producing your stage show. Yeah, we uh, we worked together with them. Uh, we built quite the the stage show. We we actually took it over to Europe first. Uh, it wor- it's one of the shows that works better in an indoor environment. And, really trippy we yeah. wanted to, to match you know the music with with the uh the visuals and do something that no rock bands really touched upon we just wanted to do something different uh it's pretty incredible i had no idea what to expect i mean do we have like chicks hanging by their hair from the ceiling and like um you know silks all over the place or on, on a good night <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> we uh it's really just really uh a visually stunning um lots of I guess like 3D animation sort of thing. Kind of makes you really feel like you're in different worlds, different places. Um, not just watching a concert. It kind of puts you in the and different of different worlds. Pretty pretty awesome. awesome. That is cool, and that's different, and that's shocking, and everything that you guys are trying to do. That's what we've been doing since day one. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but you know what? It keeps it fresh. I think you nailed it. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for being here oh, tonight. My pleasure. And thanks for talking to me. My pleasure. Cool. Event Sevenfold backstage with FM99.